check, run it back, passports when we fly. What's up, geniuses? It's your boy, Mr. Wasi G, aka Wasi G Sean. I am back with another video. Uh, before we start this video, make sure y'all follow me on Instagram, man, so y'all can stay updated on all my videos. And I'm back with another segment of Ask the Followers, where I'll be giving y'all questions to answer, and y'all answer them for me. So today's question is an excuse that you use to get off the phone i know a lot of people do it man i ain't gonna lie i do it uh when people just be talking people be chirping sometimes you don't be want to be on the phone that long so you need an excuse to get off the phone with them early so i asked y'all what is a good excuse that y'all use to get off the phone early let's get into these all right so my boy quay he said hold on right quick it never fails that's true but when you say hold on right quick do people be expecting you to like call them back that's a that's a cool excuse because I used that before. Like, hold on real quick and then like never call back. Cause people do it with me. Like people will be like, hold on, and then they get off the phone. I'll be like, man, they ain't calling back. I know they ain't calling back. So that's a good one. That's a good one. Hold on right quick. That never fails. You right, you right. All right, my boy JC said, I'm about to eat or I'm about to pull up somewhere. <laughs> hey, that's a good one. That's a good one. I'm about to eat. I mean, I'm about to eat. Nigga, you can still talk to me while you eating. You can still talk to me. So if you say that to me, I be like, man, this nigga ain't trying to talk. But I'm about to pull up somewhere. That's a better excuse. Like, I'd rather you talk while you pull up than, like, talking while you driving. That's a good excuse. That's a good one. That's a good one. All right, um, the next one. Okay, Zarya said, none. I just say, hold on and hang up. <laughs> That's wrong. You just hanging up on people? That's wrong. You might as well just be like, man, I don't even want to talk. Just, just, I'll talk to you later. Just, just tell them you'll talk to them. Don't hang up. That's rude. Sorry, that's rude. You can't be, you can't just be hanging up on people. Because if you hang up on me, I have a fit, for real. That's rude. You rude. The next one, Aaliyah said, let me get this boy ready for bed. <laughs> hey. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, that's the one I use. Now that I got a daughter now, I do use that. I do just be like, hold on, like, I gotta do something for my daughter. That's a good one. That's always the best one to use, especially when you got a kid. Let me get this boy ready for get. But you can't use that one all the time because what if it's like 1 p.m. and you talking to somebody? You gotta, you gotta switch it up so you probably be like, hold on, let me make this boy some dinner or let me make this boy lunch. You gotta think of different stuff because let me get this little boy ready for bed. It ain't gonna work all the time. It might be like five or something like that, and it ain't gonna work. Especially if you talking to me, I'ma know like, oh yeah, she ain't trying to talk. <laughs> she is not trying to talk. That's a good one, cause that's the one that I use. I ain't gonna lie, especially especially when it's late. All right, my boy, my boy John, my boy said I gotta take a shit. <laughs> okay, that's a decent one. That's a decent one. That's a good one, cause ain't nobody trying to talk to you on the phone while you taking a shit, unless like. It's your significant other or something like that. Like that's one that I can see using. I probably ain't never used that one, but that's that's. I think I gotta use that one now. I think I'm gonna use that one. I feel bad saying it because I feel like now every time I uh, before I get off the phone with somebody, they gonna think that I'm like using these excuses. So I hope people that I'm on the phone with, I hope y'all don't watch this video. I'm not making excuses. I really gotta get off the phone. So yeah, don't don't think I'm using these excuses that I'm reading off. Don't think don't think that I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. All right, the next one, my boy Vaughn. My boy Vaughn said, no excuse. Just turn airplane mode on for a good 10 seconds. Uh, yeah, that's a good one. Airplane mode. For, but they're going to call you back. 10 seconds ain't long enough. They're going to call you right back. You better uh, put that shit on do not disturb. Just put it on do not disturb. Because if, cause if I'm calling you and it goes straight to voicemail, then I won't call you back. Versus if it hang up, I think that something wrong with my phone or something like that. So that's a good one though, but me, I'm the type to call you back, brother. I'm gonna call you back. I ain't gonna fake to you. I'm gonna call you right back because I'm gonna think something wrong with my phone. Another one uh, Javon said was, hold on, my mom calling. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. It's crazy because like when I use that one, I be feeling bad. But when I use that, that hold on, my mom calling or hold on, somebody calling, you know we've been on the phone for way too long because I be like, man. At this point, I don't know what to say. Let me make up some. I ain't gonna lie. Some people just like hearing they self talk. I be on the phone with people. I be trying to talk and they be talking over me. I just be like, all right, man, I got to make up some to get off the phone with this person. So hold on. My mom calling is the perfect one for somebody that just like hearing they self talk going on and on and on. Sometimes you definitely got to use an excuse, bro. Like 
I don't want to hear you talk. Like, we supposed to be on the phone having a conversation with each other. You spending the whole time just talking to me. And every time I try to say a word, it's like, damn, you won't even let me get out a word. Like, that do be annoyance. That's the time when I use that whole on my mom calling. It's when somebody just like hearing they self talk. Like, them other excuses will probably be just if I'm on the phone with somebody and they just like, we not saying nothing. We just be on FaceTime. And I get a lot of those. Like, a lot of those. People just want to just be on FaceTime and don't say nothing. That be the most annoying the last excuse from my boy Av street chuck wood he said man let me hit you back my sister calling yeah the same one that's lying saying somebody calling knowing damn well ain't nobody calling you but that be the one where where it's like you just people just talking 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 like won't nobody use that excuse if you wasn't just talking, talking, talking. Like, if me and you just on the phone and we not saying nothing, you can be like, oh, let me hit you back. Let me just hit you back. But when you just talking, 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 then that's when I got to hit you with the, all right, bro, somebody calling me or just lying, like lying out the ass, like somebody calling me or I got to do this or I got to do that. Like, that's how you know you talk too much when somebody got to lie to you. But, hey, it is what it is. Thank y'all for tuning in to that one. That was a um, that was a fun one. Make sure y'all stay tuned for the video that I do next week. Thank y'all for all the people that participated. I appreciate it. One thing that I will start back doing that I was doing before in the previous videos is dropping motivation quote for the videos. And I do have a motivational quote today. Today's motivational quote is, when everything seems to be going against you, remember that the airplane takes off against the wind, not with it. Like when stuff seems like it's getting rough or hard, just keep going. That's pretty much like what I've been doing. Nobody's perfect. I'm not perfect. You know, we all go through our little stuff or whatever. But when stuff like seem like it's getting rough, hard, or you can't get through it, you know, you just got to keep going. That's one thing that we need to do is, is just keep going. Because if we stop, if we give up, we not hurt nobody but ourselves and our family members. But it starts with us, like for sure. It definitely starts with us. We got to keep going. That's one thing that I talk to myself about is don't get discouraged about what other people doing or don't look at what other people doing and say oh why ain't i doing it or whatever the case is uh just keep going what god got planned for you it's definitely gonna come you just gotta be consistent that's one thing that i try to preach just be consistent that's one thing i preach to myself my family anybody that's around me just be consistent as long as you be consistent you will see the results they might not come tomorrow but this stuff don't happen overnight it don't it really don't it don't happen overnight to people that's successful and, and if it do you know you just wouldn't appreciate it more versus just respecting the grind and just grinding every day you will appreciate it way more than the average person that just get the success the next day so that's the motivational quote of today thank y'all again for watching this video if you new if you haven't subscribed yet please make sure you subscribe to the channel make sure y'all follow me on instagram at ycgshyn everything all platforms is ycgshyn ycg shine make sure y'all tune in to the interviews that i got on this channel and the upcoming interviews turn on that bell so y'all can stay notified whenever i drop whenever i post whatever i'm doing new interviews coming soon make sure y'all add my main channel we out Love y'all. Peace.